Hi, Stephen here. Somebody asked me to make a video to show them what the lamp looked like inside my Venus LED conversion. So we're going to take a look inside it while I've got it out. So this is the lamp housing. And we're going to remove the screws here. those down in a safe place. So we're going to remove the lamp housing now. And this is what the LED bulb looks like. So the LED bulb is made from an old base. You can see I've marked the positive side of the LED with red here. Um, it's made from an old base and slotted onto that and with some brackets is about three inches of aluminum tubing. Then we have an octagon here which has um, the CXA 1820 LEDs on it um, which I had to, I'm trying to get the camera to focus here I had to grind those down on each side to be able to fit them onto the octagon and there glued with heat conducting epoxy and then the wire that joins the pieces the LEDs together is heat proof wire it has heat proof tubing on it because it gets very hot in there and then on the top is about two two and a half inches of aluminum and the whole thing is threaded together and so it holds it all together and there's this heat sink compound um, let me move back so you can see it a little better. And there's a fan in the top and the bottom of the saucer. So there seems to be enough cooling to keep the whole thing cool. I've run it for quite a long period of time. And it seems just fine. And it has a great light output. There's eight of the CXA 1820s. Um, it can easily reach to the other end of a um, 70 foot room. Um, and it's powered by two recon drivers connected in series with some protection diodes so there's about 280 volts at 700 milliamps going through this thing so it's it's pretty dangerous um, disclaimer I take no responsibility for anybody's injury or death if they try and imitate this design um, I would never go near it when it was on anyway. Well, plus you would get blinded by it anyway. So it's better to stay well away from that. And here you can see the heat proof wires going down from the ends of the LED chain down into the pins of the lamp. I'm not going to take the lamp out right now, but I just wanted you to be able to see and get an idea of what it looks like inside and you can see from my other videos what it looks like when it's actually working in a room okay bye for now please leave your comments below thanks